Hello, Saka Pet. Hi, I'm Roma, and welcome to my kitchen. Today, I will be making one of my favorites. It's homemade pineapple and ginger drink. If you want to see how I make this recipe, keep watching. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And hit that notification bell so you never miss an episode. Now let's get mixing. Now this drink is very easy to make. All you need is four things. You need a pineapple, fresh ginger, sugar, and water. Okay, before we start, we want to rinse our pineapple. So I'm going to just wash it off here with some cold water. And you just want to make sure you get everything off of it. It's been sitting around in the supermarket. Okay, before we start, we're going to cut this up, this top off, and then I'm going to cut this to the bottom. So what I'm going to do is peel this pineapple, but I'm going to peel it without getting too deep. I just want to barely take the top layer of the skin off. So this part I don't need, so I'm going to, just going to cut that out. You see, so I'm leaving some of it, like not a lot, but you want to get it down to this level. Now there's a lot of um, pineapple juice in the supermarket. You can buy it already made, but you know, sometimes you buy a fresh pineapple and uh, you have the skin there, it can make a good juice. Okay, so you can see like the top is gone because this is what I'm going to use for my juice. Now I'm just giving it a quick rinse again. And now I'm going to peel off what I need to make my drink. We are going to go now this way. See now, this is the way you would normally peel a pineapple. So now I'm going to take this part off. And this is what I'm going to use to make my juice. So you want to cut it down the middle. Then I'm going to take this core out. So this is going in my juice as well. Alright guys, next step we're going to put it in a pot. And I have a deep pot. I use this one just to make my drinks and that's pretty much what I do with it. So I'm going to put them everything here and you can see it's all the skin without the green. Putting it in here. Then I'm going to take it and add some water to it. So we're just going to pour it in here. Three. Actually, we could probably put one more. So that would make it like eight cups. I'm going to take that over to my stove. Turn it on high. Okay, next step guys, I'm going to slice my ginger. So I have this ginger already washed and clean. And I'm just going to slice it. And you don't have to put too much ginger. I'm putting enough because I like to taste both flavors. But this ginger is very strong. We add our ginger to the pineapple. I'm going to boil along with the pineapple. I'm going to cover it and let it boil for about half an hour. I have to bring it to a boil, then I'll turn it down. Okay, so now I have my fresh pineapple. This, I'm not going to make juice with this one. This is for eating. So I'm just going to put this away. I'm going to make a little garnish for my drink so I'm gonna keep a piece of this pineapple and there's uh, three of us here so I'm gonna put three glasses I'm just gonna cut 
three nice chunks. I have some maraschino cherries here. I'm gonna take out three of these. So what I'm gonna do is take one of that and piece of that, give it a little, and that's gonna go in my glass. Look at how pretty that is. And this, actually, I'll just taste a piece now and see if it's really sweet. Let's see. Mmm. That's a good pineapple. Okay, look at that. It's boiling up now. Look how good it is. Boiling. So now I'm just going to turn it down to medium and let it just cook for half an hour. Let's look at this. Now you can see it's been boiling for about a half an hour. And that should be fine now because you have all the flavors being extracted from the pineapple and the ginger. So we're gonna let it cool and then I'll show you the next step. Now everything's been cooled. It's been cooling for, good, I would say an hour. And now I'm gonna finish making my juice. You can see this is the liquid that the pineapple was cooked in. It's got a nice little yellow color to it. But I'm just gonna take all of this now and I'm putting it in the blender. Ginger is in there as well. And then I'm gonna pour some of that juice in there. That's it. So this is what it looks like. Now I'm going to strain it. Now this I'm going to do twice. So you're just going to take a fork and you just want to stir it up. So you get all that delicious juice going through there. Just gonna finish up our drink now guys the water that I boiled it in I pour it into this um, pitcher so now I'm just going to mix it at this point I'm going to use another fine strainer just to strain it again so if I missed any little piece of pulp went through I can get it out and there is some so I need to shake it out I'll get my fork again. So far, that was eight cups of water that we did put for one pineapple. So I'm going to start off with one cup of sugar and we will see if we need any more. That's fine. One cup of sugar is good. A little finishing touch pineapple here with our little cherry on top and we just put that on the top Add a straw in there you have cold refreshing pineapple ginger okay, I'm gonna try this very refreshing not too sweet it's just delicious and here you have it our delicious pineapple and ginger drink. Thank you for watching and we hope to see you again next time.